White flies are annoying. Worms, grasshoppers are also annoying. But you know what's one thing that's also annoying? Trips. This video is based on trips, white flies specifically. I'm going to be spraying because of them. So let's get it. I guess it's a shirt but it helps um, I'm gonna be walking over to the watermelon I'm done here with the melon the cantaloupe however you want to call it so let's continue rolling and let's finish this uh, the weather is pretty nice sunny with clouds but yeah you get the idea <music> So yes guys, I'm finally done spraying, uh, like said, in this weather, this hot weather, what tends to sprout a lot are um, trips, white flies, bugs, uh, diamond, diamond buck, moth on the cabbage, uh, many more insects and pests, but you can't get really real really rid of them you can only control it you know reduce the level of reproduction but you know that's one problem that farmers will forever face no no matter what what's the chemical what's your secret can't fully get rid of the pests that that's a fact i'm observing that some insects tend to spread and reproduce faster than other than others i mean it's because of the weather it's hot uh somehow they reproduce better in this in this temp in these temperatures but whatsoever we're gonna control them i have approximately about four thousand watermelon uh plants maybe more i, I doubt it's less cantaloupe i have about um let's put it about one point 4k 1400 could be more uh i doubt it's less uh cabbage over there my grandfather has is about 2000 heads of cabbage but the diamond back moth is a problem here that guy is terrible uh on the you know on the watermelon again i'm gonna put the trips the white flies, some little bugs, I don't know what its name, but I'm gonna still add it there for fun of it. Uh, the, the white flies reproduce very quickly, you know. If I, if 
I recall perfectly how I read. Uh, one white fly can reproduce an, up to 400 eggs, only one. And the white flies are so small, are very, very tiny. Now imagine how fast and how many eggs are reproduced daily. And that's why we have to be controlling spraying every two, three, four days. Right now I'm just using that to, you know, since the plants are small for it to be um, soaked properly, adequately. But when it comes to, um, to the fact that the plants will extend, when they extend and, and, and start um, sprouting flower, you know, getting ready for pollination, that's when I'm going to be using the blower. The blower will be more like one, two, all over. And since it covers a whole into a whole area it's a wide wide ratio so you know it would be much better I'm, I'm looking forward to do videos about that using the blower because it's going to be a more um more efficient way than the small than the pumps that you uh fabricate the wind yourself but you know with the blower yeah it's gas and two cycle oil but I'm telling you that that guy is that guy is a real helper and um i'm looking forward to use it maybe in about three weeks time maybe less two weeks maybe next week these things grow extremely fast once you take care of them fertilize them uh give them their vaccines or however but yeah that is that is the beauty of being a farmer you can your product is only good if you put in, put in good work I'm gonna make it a, a quote done by me. Your product is on. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Your product will only be good work if you. Your product will only be good product if you put in good work. Yeah, I, I think that's <laughs> that's better. Uh, uh yeah. It's like I said, it's, it's beautiful because at some point you notice how something comes from a seed, that tiny little seed, then it goes growing, it goes sprouting out. Guys, 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 a squash, a squash, a squash, a squash, a squash. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him, guys. Look at him. He, he's in the custard apple tree. Let me get closer, let me get closer, let me get closer. Look at him guys, he hasn't seen me. He hasn't seen me. He hasn't seen me. No, he is. Look at him. He's seen me now. Uh he's either gonna attack me or <laughs> or he's gonna run. <laughs> There's <no> a <laughs> Damn! He came in clutch for this video, I swear. Ah, uh, he came in clutch. He he dropped my custard apple over here. Uh, I noticed one was ready. I won't go in there. I'm, I'm kind of paranoid of of um snakes because I saw a Tommy Golf over there. But <laughs> damn, this guy came in clutch for real. Nice. Thank you, Mr. Squash. He came in clutch for real, bro. But um, yeah, this was the video for today. If you guys like it, please share, subscribe. You know the the steps, the usual steps. But yes, guys. Um, until next time.